How bad do you want it, right? How fast do you want to get there? What are your dreams? Do your actions match what you're trying to accomplish, your ambition? If they don't, then you need to step it up. It depends. I'm trying to go all out. Is work out for your brand. How do you make a difference? We make our decisions on when to stop. You know, we can start at 7 a.m., which I do every day. I drop my kids off at school at 9. I get back and I keep going. I go to my agency and I keep working hard. They leave at 6 o'clock and then I get home and I keep on working and I go all the way to 12. It depends because I'm obsessed, but you are competing only with yourself. Every single day I realize that I need to continue growing. Every single day, no matter what I accomplish, I look up to my next level. Doesn't matter what, it's a never ending process. It's not about making money, it's about making myself better. Through improving myself, I can help more people be successful themselves. So don't let people bring you down. Don't let the negative attitude of others bring you down or make you doubt your true abilities because what I've seen also along the way is that nobody really understands how powerful they are. Not myself, not my kids, not my friends, not my students, nobody. They don't really understand what they could accomplish if they decided to accomplish something. That's what happens along the way. Like, as you get good at something, your value goes up. So if somebody is really good at what they do, they're gonna be really expensive. So in reality, guys, when somebody tells you that you're working too hard, that you're too passionate, that you're too intense, that you are uh, not enjoying life, just keep in mind that it's not about that. It's just a, ma it's, 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 it's a, a, a looser mentality. It's somebody that really doesn't want you to grow and see more. It's not that they are caring for you. It's just that they see your ambition and they don't want you to get there because uh, they didn't get there themselves. So they will feel left out and out of place if they see you accomplish success and you don't. How you feel inside is how you determine yourself out there. If you feel like you're not capable, if you feel like you're not powerful, if you feel that you cannot actually go out there and learn Facebook advertising, social media advertising, content distribution, if you feel you cannot do any of that stuff, then you simply won't do it. Just growing through that. So yeah. this particular thing that you're doing right now of content creation, of editing, of recording, that is so, I, I pay a lot of money for that. Yeah. I pay him a lot of money to be here, yeah. you know? So it's really damn valuable. Yeah. It's a combination of both things, right? It's learning and then implementing that knowledge because those things join together, work together on learning and, and, and applying that knowledge is basically how you grow a business. It's basically how you form a business and how you take yourself to the next level. Common sense, being able to look around and see what's going on and realize that things are different and realize opportunities that are present and that they can actually take advantage of those opportunities. That's what we do as successful entrepreneurs. A ninja is somebody that has invested their time and energy into understanding things more than their fellow man. Because when you understand things more, you can do more things in life and accomplish more things.